Hello everyone, welcome back to Crypto Gains for another video. And in this video, we are going to be talking Pundi X. We have seen explosive gains with Pundi X over the last few weeks slash months. If you are someone that's holding Pundi X, or if you like Pundi X, or if you've been thinking about buying Pundi X, this video could help you because I'm going to break it down and show you what might happen and blah, 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 and where we've gone and yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, before I do so, please drop a like. Give me a subscribe if you're new watching. And I need to let you know I'm not a financial advisor. These are just my own personal opinions on this market. So please always do your own research before investing any money. That being said, before I even get into it, if you are someone that wants to buy Pandi X, because a, a few people say to me, like in some videos with some coins that I do, I don't know how to buy it. I don't know how to buy it. Guys, come on Coin Market Cap. Click on the search, whichever coin that you want to look for. If you're, you're curious as to where you can buy this coin. And then once you see the screen like this, you come down to markets. Even if you're on your phone, you click on market. And then it will show you all the places that you can buy these coins coins and for this case you know pundi x you can pretty much buy it anywhere so many different exchanges i just use binance i go on binance and you know i can buy it directly from there but if you're in america you may need to uh, use a nord vpn or some some to, uh, type of vpn let my words are coming out something like that so you can get past obviously to to buy it uh, but yeah that's that being said let's talk pundi x mad Crazy, ludicrous, bum, because, because Pundi X has been exploding since the last time I did a video on it, or talked about how high it can go, let me just scroll through, because I know I had uh, a video down here somewhere saying how high can Pundi X go and blah blah blah, and I think we're on that road to that journey of meeting these goals, uh, where is it, where is this thing, mummy, what is it? I, I, I can't find the video. What is wrong with you? I don't want to slap you today. <laughs> no, ma Okay, I'm talking too much. Here it is. <laughs> I'm only stopping because I've seen it here. Uh, hi. Hi. How high can Pundi X go? Guys, watch this. Because if you are a Pundi X fan and you, you, know, you really believe it can do well, I believe it can do well. I've been holding Pundi X for a long time. And I don't know. I might buy some more. I'm not sure yet. I'll see. Mm, who knows? Uh, but Pundi X, how high? In this video, I've already got it up uploaded here. I just wanted to show you there. It was sitting on 0, 0, 0, 3. And this was not long ago, guys. This was, t uh, what, two months ago? To January the 13th, two, roughly two months ago, two months and like, what, what, one or two weeks ago, we're not talking long, we're talking two months, does it even say it there as well, uh, where is it, uh, yeah, two months ago, <laughs> oh, my little mumbling. <laughs> it was only two months ago, oh, don't play it, no, don't play, what I'm trying to get at is, in the space of two months, it's jumped from zero, 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 three, to zero zero five that is over a 10x mad crazy ludicrous bomb <laughs> so <laughs> i could just imagine you guys going bomb <laughs> that's mad that's insane gains who bought back here when i was saying to you how high can pandy x go because if you did you made 10 times your money big up to you if you was paying attention but, you know, I expect a lot of these coins... Let me just push this back because I want to be on my main screen for this one. Because when I say goodbyes later on, I need... You, you, you know what I mean? Anyway, I expect a lot of these coins to be pumping up because we are in a bull market. So it's, it's very normal. But, you know, some people just don't always jump into the correct projects. You know, that's, that's another thing to say. Uh, well, because look, there's like 8,000 coins, right? <laughs> How do you know which one to jump into? And yeah, so this is why I try to make these videos is because I want to just show you what I believe in and maybe open your mind to, you know, how high they can go. So I'm going to break the market cap down view because it has done a 10x from the time that I made that last video. And I want to show you realistically if there's more room for it to grow. And we're also going to talk about the supply because there's going to be a token burn.
and I want to help a few people understand it a bit more. Actually, let's just do that now because I know a few people uh, have been asking me in the past and they're just a bit unsure and stuff and they feel, they feel like they're going to lose money when they burn the token because <laughs> some people have maybe just have a thousand of these coins and then they're thinking, oh, but I'm only going to have one coin. I want to help you understand that no matter what they do with this token burn, you will have the same value whichever amount that you have, okay? That is the most important thing to understand. Look, there is no change in the value of the tokens a user holds. So if you had a thousand and then they did the token burn and you only just had one, your price for that token will still remain the same, meaning if you bought it at 002 and, and you spent whatever amount to get that much, you're not going to have a change in your price because the essentially what they're saying here is if the price of uh, Pundi X was 002 and then they did this token burn, it should be at a market price of $2. Do you understand that? Now, I have to look back at one coin. I'm going to compare this to one coin as well when it does this. Uh, actually, maybe I'll let it do it first and then I'll compare it to that coin. Because if they're going to burn this by 1,000, then I'm guessing that, what do they do? Is it going to be like 250 something million? I'm guessing that Pundi X may have like 258 million or 250 something million. That's a big drop from uh, from having billions to millions. And if it's less than that, if it's 25 million... See, I need to I need to see what it's gonna actually be because I was I was looking through these the uh, uh, documents and stuff and the the notes and the blogs and I couldn't actually see what the actual final reduction will amount to. If someone knows what it's actually gonna be, please tell me if you know the final uh, supply of what it will be because then I can work out in my head and then I can break it down with you guys again and show you realistically how high I believe it's gonna go after that. Trust me, because if it's going as low as two hundred and fifty million. You know, <laughs> we've got something like uh, this coin here. Let me find it. You, uh, where, where is this thing? I'll show you. Hold on. Omisi Go. OMG. Because OMG has a, uh, a thingy like that. OMG has like 200 and something million or 180 million or 140 million actually to be precise. They have 140 million. So if it's going to be something similar to this, and I know that this can go up to like 68, 100 pounds, then my God, we can prepare for something special with Pundi X. But of course, remember the price of it would be more. So it doesn't even. So if you're panicking, thinking oh, I better buy now before the token burn, <laughs> it doesn't matter what you have now because they're still uh, obviously make the value so you have the same amount once you've but once they've done the token burn. Uh, but yeah, also some people may not have known you can stake your Pundi X. Did you know that? Because if you don't, now you do. You can stake it. They also have another token called MPXS. Zem XEM. I don't have that one, but you can stake these and you receive a token called Function X FX token fun Function X. If you want to know how to do this, I may put this in the, the description. It's just a little guide, a guide to staking your uh, MPX. But to be honest, guys, I I don't do it, and it could be good value. I don't even know. I haven't even seen the Function X. Let's just have a look and see, like what what kind of price is it sitting on? I haven't even. Uh, thought of doing it function x here we go this is the token that you will receive oh, okay and they're 27 pence each ross <laughs> so technically it could be good but i'm not gonna do it i've got too much staking already i'm happy with that i want to keep focused i want to wait for the token burn at least once the token burn is done then maybe i might look at considering doing this <clears throat> but that's mad and there's what there's only one is that a billion? There's only one billion available. So, just a quick analysis. Like, <laughs> I believe this could probably go up to sixteen pounds. <laughs> what billion? Yep, that's about sixteen quid. <laughs> I'm just so like sure on it. And the reason is is because most of the coins that I see with a billion token, well, this is like one almost two billion, maybe like um, eight, eight, ten pounds at least, eight to eight to ten pounds. And the reason is because. Uh, again, it depended on what it can do and what it does and blah, blah, blah. But most coins that I've seen with like a billion in total supply, they tend to go to about £16, £20. And the proof of this is, you know, like the chain links, the EOSs, uh, all these things. Polkadot got a billion as well. Let's just check because if it has, that's sitting on £27. 
Uh, let's just see, just to show you my theory, right? Uh, look, one total supply here is one billion fifty-eight million, right? So uh, I don't know. There's not a max supply on that, so that could go up. I think that's because of the stake inside of things. But let's just check another one as an example. Chainlink. Uh, you need to see this. You need to see this stuff. Like a billion again, and you know they're sitting around sixteen to what? Well, they were sitting sixteen. They're now sitting twenty-one pounds. So they've done new all-time highs. I can only imagine. That the function x would do something like that as well but anyway this is about not polka dot <laughs> this is about pundi x so yeah i hope you understand more about this in relation to the token burn because it is important Got some burp action going on there it is important and we have to, uh, have to keep our eye on it well not eye on it in the sense there's oh my god i need to change it over i think that we don't have to do anything we can just chill sit back and relax and then when we look our tokens will just be changed so, um, but yeah, just in, in a sense of keeping an eye on, like, for me, like, the, you know, the supply, how much is left, what kind of market cap, and blah, blah, blah. That's the stuff that I'm going to be looking at to see if any of that changes. Uh, but yeah, let's just talk how high it can go, because, you know, right now, it's been performing so well, 1.2 uh, billion, I was going to say million then. Let's take that, because I want to see if it can still do a, uh, do a 10x, and I think it can. Let's take this. Let me take this thing, uh, times this by 10. You were looking at a... One, sorry, a twelve billion dollar market cap, twelve billion two hundred seventy-three million. Essentially, when it does that, you could take this and then times it by ten, like that. So you'd be looking at a five pence based on what we see today. Again, I'm gonna have to do it all over again once the uh, token burn is done because you guys are gonna want to see properly like how high or low it can be. Um, but yeah, that's just a ten x, twelve billion. You see what I'm saying? And again, I've always compared these coins to XRP and things like that in the past as to how high their market cap has gone because those were what was massive in the last hype cycle. So, you know, if you're if you're considering that it could potentially do 100 billion, then, you know, there's a lot more room to grow. But that's just 10x right there. I mean, if you want, you could do a 20x because <laughs> some people are like, well, can I still get 20x out of this? Times this by two, you'd be looking at a $24 billion market cap that's a 20x so essentially where i took this and shimmed it over by one for a 10x which is five pence you'd probably be looking at a 10 pence price for pundi x when it reaches a 24.5 billion dollar market cap and let me just show you what a 10 pence looks like actually i'll show you what a five pence looks like because what well, in dollars because i know it's a bit different what is it eight cents point one there you go zero five so the zero five is about seven cents and uh, when it hits 10 pence you'd be looking at a 14 cents price for pundi x that's mad but it's possible because i'm not talking hundreds of billions i'm just talking this and you know i i love the project i've been super hyped on this from you know what to be fair like after xrp because like when i first got into it i was trying to figure out what coins i should grab pundi x was one of the first coins that i got because i believed in the project <laughs> i didn't even read it properly back then i was just like oh you're trying to make um uh crypto as easy as like a glass of water like because that's what they're, they're i think water water <laughs> water <laughs> a glass of water you're trying to make pundi x as easy to use or to spend as easy as someone having a glass of water something like that that was their slogan i'm trying to find it through here where is it i know they said it somewhere buying digital currency should be as easy as buying a bottle of water there you go a bottled water there you go that's what i was trying to say and i like that that makes a lot of sense and they're right it should be that easy because what well, they're making it super easy now I mean, you know you can buy cards and stuff and again this xbox i can just see it in every single shop i see people buying and just scanning it with their crypto or their phones beep. <coughs> beep. is that all beep. that's all young man beep. okay um that's 37 pounds please uh, uh, but, 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 do, do you have uh, pandy x i'm sorry i don't understand you do you have okay i'm not gonna do this too much <laughs> just laugh with me because you made a 10x if you was in pandy x I'm not going to say no more. I just wanted to open your eyes to this. I wanted to talk to you about the function X. I wanted to talk to you about the uh, uh, token burn. If this was helpful to you, please drop that like, guys. Give me a subscribe if you are new watching. And I want to do a super special thank you to all my Patreons. Let me grab up my page. If you haven't become one, you are most welcome to become one. I mean, I know my name My name call is going to get longer. <laughs> this is like sitting in a class <laughs> calling all the students' names. <laughs> I swear to God, it's too, it's too, okay, I'm talking too much, it's just too long, <laughs> shh, 
Shout out to Daniel Atkins, Toy and Artery, but I appreciate it. Thank you. Glenda, It's Time, Cobra Black, SM, I Dry, Tassim Wahi, Tony Dan, Michael Costanti, Jazz, Azari, Michael, AJ, Frank C63, Clarence Dennison, Honcho the First, Christopher Johnson, Jacob Adams, Mr. Anonymous, Captain Good Smoke, Surad Shakla, Lewis Roach, Latasha F, Axel, Carlos Rocha, or Rocha, Mr. Tough Fu, Damaris, Naj Bogan, Dan Cox, Rahul de God, Don T. Kennedy, RG, Brittany, Bizzle, Raffle, Kakinski, Mass, uh, Mass, Max, Ken- <laughs> Kenneth Whitley, I want to say Wisem, 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 Marcello Trevino, or Marcelo Trevino, I think it's Marcello, Redex, I think it's Redex, Robinson, Manny Sanchez, Catherine Cheung, Tyrone Samuel, Stephen Edward, Luca Reno, Abiola, Rachel Mack, Dwayne Suda, Evan Fong, Bola, Pamela Williams, Brandon, Stacks on Racks, Stan Kyle, Rick, Geoffrey Williams, Eric Eubank, I told you it was long, <laughs> what am I laughing for, Omar Thomas, Casper Nell, Aaron Davis, oh my days, literally, I feel like I've just done half the page, <laughs> Damian Hunter, Rion Wade, re- Restored by Life, get that out, Ali Jill, CCP269, Good Feels Nice, Mm-hmm. It definitely feels nice. Aaron White, Lucas, Albert Lynn, Aaron B, For Honor Man, Dominic, Alexander Mangion. I think I said that right. Or Alexander Mangion. One of those. Let me know on a Patreon if I said it wrong. Do apologize. Will W, Peter Stoddard, and Belinda Spencer. My God. Thank you so, so much. And that's not with a th, th. That's with a f. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> now guys thank you so much i really appreciate that um and all the new patrons as well i see you my god mad crazy ludicrous yeah you know that i heard you say that i can hear it <laughs> if you liked it please drop that like give me a subscribe and i look forward to seeing you in my next video cheers <laughs>